Hello guys, Fitch from Lantern Hill, and I got you here for my very first combo tutorial with Wayne. It's been a long time since I've done a combo tutorial, but in practice mode, I was just Wayne doing best around with Hydro Boost here, and uh, you can actually combo off this meteorously. It's so cool, so I just wanted to show you guys it. It's pretty amazing, and the highest damage I got so far was 39 one board, because you can uh, you can uh, do Hydro Boost again for meter bonus, so. I'm gonna slowly show you how to do the combo and the first thing we're gonna do is well technically you can do any string into a meterless hydro boost like you can do 1 3 2 4 2 4 2 or any other string but you can't do 1 3 3 because you know you got march in the air but I'm gonna sh show you right now so the first thing that we're gonna do is daily tsunami which is 2 4 2 which is what I'm gonna show you because it does the most damage so you do 2 4 2 and then you do the Miller's Hydro Boost. Like that. And then as they come down, whenever you come back and we uh, recover from the animation, you do 1-3. Thicker than water. See, like that. Just like that. And then uh, whenever you do 1-3, you do the uh, Meter Bone Hydro Boost and then when you do the Hydro Boost, you do a jump kick. Like this. Let's see if we can get it. Like that. You see, if you get the jump kick like that, we're already at 32 with just one ball. And then uh, whenever you uh, land the kick, you do 242 to 1 plus 3, which is this endo right here. It's a great uh, corner endo to keep him in the corner. And you're right next to him as the ground, so good Oki and stuff like that. And it does 39 one ball, it's quite crazy. I'll show you why heal. Okay, there we go, finally. I hit the combo. It, it took me a couple tries, but yeah, it's a super hard combo. Like, it's, in my opinion, probably the hardest combo to actually perform in this game. Even though some of the combos are not that hard. Some characters have really pretty hard combos. But that one right there was... It's really hard. So, uh, a safe alternative in my opinion would just be like 1-3 uh, like into the ball. Uh, the push. But uh, actually trying to do that, uh, that would actually not work. I don't know why. So I'm guessing like uh, stand 3 I guess into it. I don't know. As, a, uh, as you jump kick 3 into that. Something like that. Or, um, in this custom variation, I have the water ball, which you can actually do 1-3-3 three, three water ball after the meterless one, which is, uh, quite cool. So that'd be quite of a safe alternative for this combo, even though that combo did 39. The, the combo with the water ball, which I'll show you, does 36, so you're not really missing out on damage, plus it's a one ball combo, and all that cool stuff. Yeah, see, like that combo right there. 36, 2. That's really good for one boss, too. I mean, that's quite crazy. That's like spawn level of damage or like Kodakon one ball damage. Like, I mean, it's quite nuts. So, that, that in my opinion, will probably be something that you do. A uh, more safer, a safer combo to do because a lot of times you try and do the 39. Uh, the last part right here, the grab, would actually whiff. And it'll put you at 36 damage, so it's probably the same as if you're whiffing the last part when you do the actual combo. But, yeah, that'll be the end of this video. Hope you all like to enjoy, and see you next time.